A city imbued with the spirit of excitement and a stadium enveloped by anticipation. This has all the ingredients necessary for a tasty football recipe. And both sets of players are ready to throw everything into winning the game for their fans. A mouth-watering prospect awaits. This is EA TV. And welcome on a rainy night. The heavens opened earlier and it just hasn't relented. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary box providing expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And coming up, it's the Cup quarter-final first leg. It's Eintracht Frankfurt up against West Ham United. Well, thanks, Derek. This could be a okay. case. There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important... Oh, what a clearance under pressure. Had to react and did. Crossed into the penalty area. Can she finish here? Sizoko. Kirsty Smith. Could play it in. Laura Freigang. Oh, great attacking play. Could be. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Well, they are behind, but can they give themselves a boost with this corner? Dunst and having a go now breaking at pace potential danger and what an opportunity this is for her it's got to be and nearly the perfect break but no target but what a good counter attack that was well she's not happy is she this isn't over just yet from there and I suspect she knows it Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Tusiak. Abby Lee Stringer. And options in the centre. Real chance. And a goal it is. But offside is the verdict. Well, that was really close. Great decision by the assistant. chance oh great goalkeeping well that's a top quality save great anticipation hey in possession this could square the game oh that's top-notch goalkeeping you've got to say Kirsty Smith Sizoko Amber Tusiak. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And teammates around her. And is she going to score from here? And it goes! The leveller! Thrilling stuff here! Well, let's take another look. And you have to say the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there.
So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Stringer. Time running out, but they could yet win it. She's on her own in the centre. And a goal! At this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Well, just look at her reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for her team. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Dunst. And so into the final five minutes. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. And that's a straightforward stop. And the cross into the middle. And there goes the final whistle. It's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie. Well, I thought they were the better side. They controlled the flow of the game and looked dangerous going forward. But they'll need to perform just as well in the second leg to go through. The day is here. The match everyone has been talking about and with good reason. Two teams of strong pedigree, rich in talent, on the cusp of going head-to-head -head in a highly significant confrontation with so much to play for. How will it pan out? And it's live right here on EA TV. Hello, great to be with you. We're here in Stratford at the London Stadium a ground built originally for the Olympics in 2012. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you the second leg of this quarter-final tie. It's West Ham United, and they take on Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, the visitors have it all to do here, Derek, but a quick start, an early goal, and they'll be right back in it. This should be good today. Atkinson. She fancies it. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Chance to cross. And a good looking pass. Targets available. Cross comes in. Asayi. Nicely saved. Open up the defence. And it's in! As they tighten their grip on the tie! Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. But I'm not sure the keeper should be beaten at that near post. She won't enjoy seeing that again. Couldn't keep it. Shimizu. Awa Sizoko. Kirsty Smith. Spraying passes around, almost waiting for the opposition to make a mistake. They do pass the ball with authority. Has eyes for goal! Well, I'll tell you what, surprising everyone by taking on the shot from that range. Yeah, that was certainly a good effort from that sort of distance. Really struck it cleanly. Verena Hanshaw. On to Kirchberger. Really clever pressing. 
Real chance. Not quite the level of accuracy she was hoping for. And that'll be a goal kick. Kirsty Smith passing it accurately. Well, possibilities in the centre. Could be. Oh, a good diving save. Oh, she's been denied by the post and might consider herself unfortunate. Accurate from the keeper. Risa Shimizu. Ten minutes to go then. Well, a really good run. Opportunity here. What a vital intervention. And they will make the change now. Short corner it is. Teammate and support. And that's a very good parry. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Oh, what an opportunity. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. That's a great finish. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. Reutler. There's the final whistle. The home fans are jubilant. They are going through. Well, you can't say they didn't deserve it. They were by far and away the better team over the two legs, and the result was never much in doubt. I'm sure they'll face a sterner test in the next round, but they'll be full of confidence off the back of that performance. Match day is upon us. Fans are pouring into the stadium. Anticipation has reached an all-time high. All the action here on EA TV. Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And the tension is palpable because we've reached the semi-final stage of the UEFA Women's Champions League. This, the first leg. Stuart, what are you expecting to see? Well, Derek, it's said that semi-finals are the best games to win and the worst to lose. And while the hosts are clear favourites, I still think this could be a great match. Full of individual battles, a lot of passion and great skill as well. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Well, they're going to play with two wingers in this 4-3-3 formation. So they need to switch the ball quickly and get crosses into the box. But they also need to get at least two midfield players making runs into the penalty area. That's a must. That's not a bad ball. And there it is! The first goal in the semi-final! A huge moment! Extraordinary scenes! Well, here it is again. And what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Tusiak. Sizoko. Now, who can she play it to? Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Graham Hansen. Bonmati. She's made a really important challenge. 
And threading it through. Real chance. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And there it is! A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, just look at this again. It's good movement. The timing of the pass is perfect. And they leave the goalkeeper with no chance. That's an excellent goal. Well, she looks very pleased. Oh, this is looking promising. Can't miss, surely. And she finds the back of the net. Right place, right time. And delivering for her team. Well, let's look at this again. The cross just couldn't be any better, could it? Whipped into that danger area, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. Well, strong play here. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Great opportunity. Looked like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. That was the chance they could get caught out on the break here. Oh, she scored again. A brace for her today. They simply don't know how to stop her. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And when through on goal, she makes no mistake. She just hits it so cleanly and with power. That's a great finish. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Oh, chance perhaps. Simple catch, really. Shimizu. Risa Shimizu. Evans. Stringer. On to Shimizu. Ten minutes to go, then. Oh, in with a chance! And there it is! And no wonder she's off celebrating! Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And just look at that finish. 1v1 against the keeper, and she hits it with power. It's a great goal. Well, that's what she wanted. She has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Shimizu. Sloppy in possession from West Ham. Well, she's certainly not alone. Shown inside. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Oh, that's a fine save. <laughs> Delivering it. And they could face difficulties here. Just couldn't get it through. And so the referee confirms that this first leg is officially over. Just what the away fans were hoping for. Now they've got to hold their nerve when the action moves to their patch next time round. Yeah, and what a performance it was. You can see the confidence in these players. The belief has been growing with every game. This tie's not over yet, but they must know... Bar a day for clearing the decks, because this is the UEFA Women's Champions League final. There can be only one winner. Who will come out on top? Manchester City, they take on West Ham United, and it's live. And a 
it all comes down to this the final of the UEFA Women's Champions League it is Manchester City up against West Ham United well it's been a long journey for both these teams Derek it's not been easy but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves no oh it might happen for her here it's got to be and a goal it is the keeper really not part of the equation Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end, but what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. And back underway, 1-0 it is. <laughs> Kelly. Yui Hasagawa. Good-looking sequence. Shimizu and slipped through beautifully it's got to be and a goal I'll tell you what they're going to be very hard to catch now name on the trophy maybe well as you can see what a good bit of play this is the build up is excellent one and two touch passing clever movement and a fairly simple finish great team goal well no wonder she's delighted they're bossing the game now so back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0 Chloe Kelly well she's gliding through that's a useful cross pressing like that will help the cause piece of defending well so close to extending their lead there just a matter of inches Lisa Evans they really look after the ball when they have it crossing possibilities lack of guile with regard to that cross goalkeeper's ball Well, she keeps moving. Effective hold-up play. Really getting stuck in. Hayashi. Incisive pass. And the alarm bells are ringing. Ball is loose. Risa Shimizu. Superbly to take back possession. Lauren Hemp. Now with Ward. And so the first half has come to an end here at the San Mames. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. And a play for a Manchester City throw-in. 
And Manchester City will go to their bench. This attack looks highly promising. Will she shoot? The fans hope so. Pretty simple for the keeper. Shimizu. Abby Lee Stringer. Really good challenge. And Arnold has it now. On to Shimizu. Oh, good vision. And they could do damage. Oh, there it is. She's bagged another one. Two in this game now. What a performance we're witnessing. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. So, back in action, and it's looking rather like a matter of how many for West Ham here. Chloe Kelly. Tusiak. On to Shimizu. The switch of play now. Opportunity. And just wide of the target at the end. Well, good effort, but I think the goalkeeper did have it covered. Just 15 minutes remaining. Good technique display. Real chance. Oh, that is a superb save. Hayashi. That's a good looking ball. In position. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and the movement is so good that they end up with a 2v1 against the goalkeeper who was completely exposed. Great play, but poor defending. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Greenwood. And Hasegawa. Khadija Shaw. Going well. And hit with ferocity. Well, the shot looked promising, but the keeper had the measure of it. Smith. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Played towards the near post. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. 
and this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. There's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. Really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.